Hi, this is Nellie Deutsch, and today I'm going to show you how to use H5P. I want to remind you that with the new Moodle, H5P is part of the content bank. And it appears on the editor. Going to go into site administration. I'm on a Moodle site called ESSO for us. Going to go into this is a Fortson theme for 3.10.3. Got editing turned on. I'm going to go to add an activity or resource over here since we're looking at H5P. Notice H5P appears twice in blue and in black if you've added it. So here it is in black. All right, let's click on the blue. Notice it's under activities. Okay, now I want to add something. Notice this is a requirement. We'll just call it test. Scroll down and notice what appears here. The content bank opens in a new window and you've got options here, grade and so on. But let's take a look at the content here. Here, if I click on add, I can add and choose from the content bank. Notice what's available here. If you'd like a memory game, you click on it and there it's loading and, um, and you can use it. That's how easy it is. Notice the behavioral setting position, look and feel, theme color, text overrides and so on. And then you simply save it. You need to give it a title, just call everything test. And here, text for image. I haven't added an image yet, but okay. Um, let's see if there's any other requirement. I'll just save it. I haven't done anything, okay, but you need to do that. All right, now I have the test listed here. Now, out a recorder, I'm recording my voice and I can add that. Okay, so let me um, stop it by going to done. Okay, so there it is. Okay, let me stop it and um, and close. Okay, so notice I've got two activities, test and another test. Okay, so let's go back to, that's under content bank notice. That's how you keep adding, okay, to your course. Uh, let's go on to another activity. Notice I'm only using the blue because the black, as I said, is old. Forget about the black. Ooh, uh, Anywhere where I have a description of the editor. In this case, I'm going to add it to a form. The form has editors. Everything on Moodle has editors. There's the editor. I'm going to open it up. Notice I'm going to call it test again. And in the editor, you'll notice I have H5P. I'm going to click on the H5P, and that's going to give me options. First of all, how do I want it to appear? Allow download, embed, copyright. And then I go into the browse repositories where I want to get my H5P. I'm going to get it from my content bank. You can see over here. I can search for it or I can see it down here. Notice as an icon and as text. So let me click on one of these since I gave them. And then I'm going to select the file insert h5p and there it is okay whatever i added next i'm going to display the description if that's what i want to do and then save and display now notice this is the card memory game so um i didn't do very much let's go into the recordings i think that was a lot better let me add a new discussion topic record and i'm going to call go into open it up first of all h5p this time browse and this time i'm recording i think it was this one let's see audio record yes select that's what happens when you give it the same name you should not do that all right now i'm going to post to forum but let's make sure that i have added it to appear pinned okay all right let's um 
wait for that to come up. Your post was added. Okay, now I've got the record. Let me go into it. And there it is. There's my H5P. I can record now. This is for students, of course, to record because you want their recording. And that's it. Um, hope this has been of help. Let me click Done. Now you can either download it because I've added that, or you can simply record now. This is for students, of course, to record because you want their... And that's it. Let me know if you... Okay, so uh, feel free to add your questions in the comment box and subscribe. Thank you for watching. And remember, H5P, things change on Moodle all the time. So what worked a few weeks or on a different Moodle version before in a certain way may not work a few weeks later. So be aware of that. Stay up to date and ask questions.